Hey guys, Ace is here from NetworkMarketing.com, and today what I want to talk about is it's never too late. Now the reason I want to talk about this, guys, is because as you can see, I'm actually in my gym clothes right now, and uh, it's because I actually got from the, uh, back from the gym not too long ago, and I was kind of inspired because of something that happened this week, and so I wanted to share this with you guys. It'll be only be a couple of seconds. So um, it's been a very hectic week this week, right? So I'm talking about getting up before five o'clock in the morning, and you know going to bed at midnight if not later right so I'm not getting very much sleep here so if I look tired I'm, I apologize but um, because of that though you know I've, I've still managed to make the time you know to be able to reach out to you guys to send you guys these daily emails and, and you know hopefully motivate you guys or at least educate you guys on things that you haven't known so far and um, and the point is though that in the process of all this right of this hecticness you know I kind of neglected myself you know I didn't make it out to the gym throughout the course of the week and now it's Thursday so when I got up today I had a decision to make I could have either said, well, you know what, it's Thursday, I've already missed the gym three days in a row, and it's a bit of a busy day for me today again. Um, I can either just wait and, you know, maybe get back to the gym next week, it's just, you know, I'll take this week as a break, or I can suck it up and go to the gym. <laughs> okay, guys, so I take my health pretty seriously, you know, I love heading out to the gym, and by this point in the week, I usually have three workouts in, uh, or at least two to three, you know, workouts in by this point in the week, right? So... For me to not have that means that I'm going to have to make up some time. So I went to the gym today and I actually got a great workout. Uh, you know, and after you you know work out, you, you never regret it, right? It's just getting to the gym, right? Or getting to getting to that workout. That's usually the toughest thing. And so probably tomorrow I'm going to be heading back and then through the weekend. And usually the weekend is the time I like to take some time off the gym so I can enjoy my weekend. But I'm going to probably get to the you know to the gym between that now and then to make up for the lost time that I had throughout the course of this week. Now, why am I telling you guys this? Not because I want to show off about well, how I'm working out at the gym or to you know motivate you to go to the gym, but if there is a fitness goal maybe that you've been putting to the back burner, this is, it can relate very, very much similar to something that a goal you may have for your business. So even though I had to wait until Thursday to get myself getting back into the gym this week, right? I still started Thursday as if it was my day one, right? I started my routine like I normally do, something that I would normally do on a Monday, I did on a Thursday. And why? Because I know I have to make up for lost time, but I don't want to lose what it is that I, that, uh, you know, that what I've been working towards, uh, you know, for the last few months and years, you know, because I've been working out consistently for, for a very long time. Your business is very much the same way, guys. You know, a lot of the times we make excuses, right? I know life is busy. I know life can get in the way. But if we're serious about our business, if we're serious about the goals that we want, uh, that we want to accomplish, if you're serious about, you know, wanting to help retire your parents, if you're serious about wanting to retire yourself from your job, if you're serious about being able to take your your family on that vacation that you've never been able to take them on or never been able to afford, if you're serious about being your own boss and building a business for yourself and leaving a legacy, if you're serious about all that stuff, guys, that's a, that's some monumental stuff. That's some serious stuff that you you know you've 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 set for yourself, but. It's never going to happen if you don't get going, okay? And a lot of times, we, we wait for perfection, right? We wait for that ideal time, right? An ideal time for me to get going to the gym would have been on Monday. But it's Thursday, and I'm still doing day one. And I'm going to have to make it make it up on the weekend, right? But for you and your business, right, sometimes we wait for the perfect time. You know, I, I don't know if I, can, if I can make the time to work on a business. Or I don't know if I can afford to get started with a business. These are excuses that we make for ourselves. Right, guys, if we just make a decision that we want to be successful, that we want to accomplish something, then it's not a matter of, of, of the how. The how works itself out. You can, you'll find a way to make it happen, right? Because you're passionate about it and you made a decision that you're going to make this happen, right? You can't be waiting for the, per for the perfect time. To so wait for the perfect time, the perfect time never comes because it doesn't exist. Practice doesn't make perfect. Practice makes improvement. But for you to be able to make improvement, you have to take action. And that's the most important thing. So you need to get, your, get off your rusty dust. You have to get off your ass and actually get going on things that you need to do. So guys, basically this video is just hopefully to motivate you guys on on getting started. So far, you you know maybe you you you've lost some time between between when you decided to make this goal and today, but today should be the day that you take action. Okay, whether it's been you you know getting wanting to get started in the business and uh, getting yourself going, and if you're still deciding what it is you want to do, well you know what I'll let you know what I'm doing, what's you know working for me. I'll leave the link below so you guys can check that out. But you know if maybe it's a fitness goal that you wanted to do, then get to the gym tomorrow, sign yourself up if you're if you're not a member yet, or even if you are a member and you haven't showed up in the last two months, go back there and start again day one. All right, but the point is you have to start now so that you're looking good for the summer. Right? Don't let another summer pass you by. Don't let another six months pass you by. Don't let another week pass you by. Right? Start going. So just start taking action as soon as you can because as soon as you're taking action, you're going to see results. Okay, guys? It's as simple as that. Remember, I've given you guys the, the secret to basically keep building your business. Right? It's just a simple three step process. But the 
but the thing is you need to take action and actually do the three steps. If you don't take action on those three steps, you're never gonna you're never gonna get your business going. Okay guys, so I hope this message guy reaches you. I hope it hits home to you guys and I hope it helps motivate you and get you off and gets you guys off your asses, you know, to, to take some action. And until next time guys, this is get out there and have some fun.